Hey, this is Matt Matheny from California Trout. We're out here at our Cochrane Creek restoration project. So Cochrane Creek up behind me, we've got spawning habitat up here in the valley. This hasn't been accessible to adult salmon for a long time due to the old top hinge tide gate, which would just open real quick and then close again. And it made it for a really awkward fish passage. Right now we're on the face loose side of things. This is the side of the levee behind me that was open to the Humboldt Bay. On the other side of this levee is the area where the restoration took place. And we've put in a new tide gate going through this levee that allows fish to go in and out a lot more freely than they used to. It's a new side hinge tide gate that is gonna open whenever the tide is going out. It's gonna let fish, both juveniles and adult salmon, go in and out as they please. And now, after all of these maybe 100 plus years, adult salmon are gonna be able to get up into Cochrane Creek to spawn. We've restored a tidal influence to a huge area in the field behind us here. And this is very productive rearing area with lots of food where fish can grow big and fat all winter long and hopefully through the summer too. We're gonna have coho salmon rearing in here. We're gonna have cutthroat trout, steelhead, and maybe chinook as well. So we're gonna get the whole suite of North Coast salmonids in here. One of the main benefits or one of the key parts of this project is that it's benefiting both fish and the working farm landscape on the other side of the levee here. The farmer was previously encountering constantly flooded fields throughout the winter because Cochrane Creek had been pushed up against the side of the field and along the levee in a series of right angle turns. The creek had gotten really sedimented in and was just flooding whenever there was a rainstorm. So we've dug a huge new channel. It's gonna increase the drainage. It's open to the tide, so it's not gonna get clogged up with sediment anymore. And while the farmer did lose a few acres of land, the land that he got in exchange is gonna be a lot more functional for him. So this is a great place where we can satisfy the needs of fish and of farmers.